Hello, hello, hello everybody. How are you all doing? It's me, Karen Maloney. I am back with another short nugget today. I am your inside out coach helping you with mindset, spirituality, and self-worth. Inside first, outside follows, always. And today's little nugget that I'm going to share really highlights this. And it's this idea of cause and effect, cause and effect, cause and effect. So what is the cause? What is the effect? You know, there cannot be a cause without an effect and there cannot be a, an effect without a cause. So the effect is essentially like the end product, the outpouring, the final picture, you know, the emotion, the reaction, the war, the whatever. But then what is the cause? And according to A Course in Miracles, the cause is our thoughts. So in order to change the effect, the end product, the outpouring, what we're seeing, we have to change our thoughts. As Wayne Dyer said, change your thoughts, change your life. It cannot be any other way to just focus on the external and to fight against that or to try to change that without actually changing our thoughts. It's futile and it's not long lasting. Because again, our thoughts, we're often not conscious, but a thought precedes everything. You know, and our thoughts really have the power to, well, they do create our life, but they have the power to shift it as well, because it's all based on our own internal workings, our subconscious beliefs, but our thoughts create our meaning, they create our perception, they create how we interpret things. So in order to change the effect, to see something different, we have to start with our thoughts. We have to start, it's like starting at the very beginning here, to just work here, not long lasting, futile. We have to take the steps back to get curious, become aware. What are we thinking in the first place? Is it constructive? Is it deconstructive? How can I shift them to help elevate myself, to grow, to perceive and to see and to create new effects in our lives? That's, that's essentially it. And even Neville Gardner would talk about how our ability to use our imagination, so to think new thoughts, to elevate our thoughts, that ability to use our imagination. Neville Goddard talks about how our imagination is God, whatever word, God, creation, source, universe. That's, that's where creation lives. It's in our imagination. But it's up to us to do the work, to change our thoughts, to change the cause in order to change the effects. And when we do this individually in our own lives, massive shifts. But also when we do this individually, as a collective, we change our whole world. Change your thoughts, change your life. It's not just for you. This is the work we're all being called to do, each of us individually, changing our own thoughts, to change our own lives, to change the whole collective. As they say, it doesn't come from the top down. It has to start with us. It starts from within. It starts with the cause. The cause is our thoughts. So let me know what you think. Do you pay attention to your thoughts? Do you try to become aware, to elevate them, to shift them, to even be curious? Why are you thinking these thoughts in the first place, especially if they're negative and really destructive towards yourself or towards another? Start the inner process, start getting curious. And again, as always, if anyone needs any support, this is what I'm here for. Please reach out and let me know how you get on. Talk soon.